Hello, Dr. Burke here. In this video, we're going to talk about gout and ketosis. In certain individuals that are predisposed to having high uric acid crystals or even kidney stones, um, ketosis can aggravate the situation. And intermittent fasting can also cause a retention of, of uric acid in certain people too, which doesn't normally lead to gout, but it can increase more um, uric acid. So what are you going to do about that? Well, there's two simple things you can do because when you have uric acid crystals, uh, one remedy would be lemon juice. Okay, so that's, this is why I recommend consuming a good amount of lemon juice in your diet when you do this because it's going to actually counter uh, oxalates, uric acid, and uh, uh, help flush things out. The other thing that you could do is you can do the electrolyte powder, which has 1,000 milligrams of potassium citrate. Potassium citrate is really good for gout because it alkalizes this acidic uh, state, overly acidic state, and it helps reduce the symptoms of gout and helps neutralize the uh, uric acid buildup. Now, one important point is that this uric acid buildup is usually only in the first few weeks. It's not when you're fully adapted to ketosis. It's, it's in the adaptation. That's why a lot of things shift and change when you're in the keto adaptation phase. Uh, you might have, you know, keto flu, you know, a rash, fatigue, things like that, and even like a flare-up of gout. In summary, it's probably not going to be a problem for you, but if you start feeling pain in your big toe, as in gout, uh, start increasing the potassium citrate or the lemon juice. All right, thanks for watching. Hey, you probably already subscribed, but if you haven't, press this little button down below and I will keep you updated.